Hello, hello. Come on in this room, honey. It is time for the divine message for the collective. I am Tiara Chardé, and let's just hop right in, all right? All of the info to get in contact with me is in the description box. Um, this is a beautiful message for someone, okay? There's many different things going on that I'm picking up, and um, I feel like for many of you, you have made a decision to move forward on your path, all right? And this is a timeless message, right? But this is... Um, for the week, for the week of the 10th, but um, it's a timeless message. Energy is fluid. And also I do want to say, take what resonates. If this is not your story, leave it alone, baby, and mind your business. It belongs to somebody else, okay? It's somebody else's story. But um, I feel like many of you this week, you're going to be, I heard circumventing? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> you're going to be bypassing um, toxicity. I feel like this is the week for some of you where there's someone around you or your environment, just energies in your environment overall that are, that may try to come in to knock you off your square, knock you off the throne, get you riled up, get you acting out of character. The divine wants you to know to leave it alone, leave those people alone don't go to that side of town don't hang out over there don't allow anyone to get you riled up right now this week is the week where you buckle down and you take the time to nurture your crafts and your goals and to journal and do that inner work and if you are angry with anyone to um go within and seek inner counsel first seek spiritual counsel first before you maybe address that person or maybe you'll find that there's no need to address address that person at all because you've healed things and you've regulated things within yourself so it's like look you could do whatever you want baby i'm good so to, for someone that's what's going on um for others of you like i was saying this is this week is going to display a successful um, graduation of sorts, a successful graduation. I feel like in the past you were popping off. So watch, watch the um, divine message for the collective, the weekend video that I just did, right? I feel like on the weekend you might've been popping off, you know, you might've been quick with the tongue. It's, it's okay, I get that, right? But I feel like this week, you're going to regulate all of that. And um, you're going to leave that behind. Um, some of you made New Year's resolutions, and maybe that's what's coming up. And I'm just sensing that. But I feel like for others of you, this is something bigger. This is like a spiritual thing. This is a spiritual graduation. You are on one level. Say you are on level four, because I, I love the number four. Say you are on number four. And you, you've been fighting on number four. You've been going for the gold. You've, you've been hopping those, those hurdles. You know, you've been dodging the bandits and all of that. And you've successfully completed level four. So this week is level five, right? Hypothetically. This week, you're on level five. You've graduated. So congratulations to you. And on this level are more of the things that you've been wanting to manifest, right? Because you've already healed. You already passed the tests. On level four you're good you cleared you know you fought the big bad guy at the end and you was able to get to the next level so on this new level it's higher there's more there's different opportunities you're going to meet different people you're going to be presented with other things um for many of you you're gonna have second chances i, I just heard like multiple second chances for some of you this could absolutely pertain to love this could absolutely pertain to career maybe you're uh restarting or jump starting your career or relaunching a, a certain thing um that is definitely going to be successful for you for others of you this you know this pertains to a relationship you could have gotten out of a relationship and um some of you have been on a healing journey of cleansing releasing purging Maybe you've been celibate for a while. Maybe you've been detoxing for a while. And on this next level, 
is romantic union for many of y'all is um you know the consummation of a twin flame relationship like i was saying in previous videos 2022 is the year of marriages you're going to have a baby for many of you you're going to purchase that home that car you're going to launch that new brand um, and I feel like this week is going to be a really, really, really great week for you to work on that and also to launch it. For many of you, this week is a great week to um, to plan and strategize on how you want to move forward in a particular thing. And you're going to be really successful with it. OK, some you may you may be trying to conceive or. Um, it's advised for you to do whatever healing that you're needing to do so that you can conceive. And for others, this is uh, a creative endeavor that you're that you're wanting to do. So maybe you're detoxing, maybe you're meditating more, maybe you're going to the gym just to kind of release some energy and some toxins and to gain more clarity so that you can move forward on a creative project, okay? I also was getting that somebody has been waiting a really long time for something. A really, really, really long time. So say like you've been waiting a long time to write a book, all right? You've been putting it together. You've been gaining your courage. You've been outlining it. You might have gotten second opinions on your content or whatever it is. Um, and I feel like this week or maybe the next week definitely this month for somebody you're going to be launching something that you've you've had inside of you for a long time i just heard you've been holding it in inside for a long time maybe you're you're gonna say something that you've been holding on to for a long time that yeah you know that kind of came up too before like somebody is wanting to say something that they've just been holding inside of their body and it's, it's just driving them crazy and it could be really anything it could be saying it could be them saying you know i love you or it could be hey this this situation happened i just really need you to know like i just really need to talk to somebody um which ties into the video that i just did like about the song angel um send me an angel so i feel like you could be somebody's angel that they've been waiting for and that they've been um just needing someone to hear them out without judgment. Um, I feel like you could be that for someone. There's going to be um, definitely a renewal of something within someone's life. This could be a renewal of passion for your craft, a renewal of you tapping into your spiritual foundation, um, a renewal of mind, body, soul. So say like you've been working on your health and wellness, this, this is that renewal. Somebody is also waiting for the answer to something. Um, I don't know if you made an inquiry about something, but um, you're waiting for a response. I feel like the response is going to be favorable for the most part, for most of you. This could be a job interview. I feel like some of you, the response is going to be favorable, especially for someone who may have gotten a lot of no's before. Um, and also, what came with that is if you have been getting a lot of no's is because maybe what you're doing isn't aligned with your purpose and you're needing to just realign with that purpose um, in order for things to move forward for you. But I see a lot of money. I see a lot of stability for somebody. I see a lot of um, notoriety and respect that somebody is going to, to get. And I feel like it's, it's, a long time coming but it's also because of what you've already put in right so somebody out there you've already put in a lot of work you've already shown a lot of integrity and you know sound ethics and values and you're going to reap the rewards of what you've already put in or what you've already created okay so that's coming up this week y'all um and again, I, you know, I got this in the last message, but I feel like somebody has been waiting a long time for you. I don't know what it is. This could be your soul tribe that has been waiting a long time for you. This could definitely be um, a love interest that has been waiting a long time for you. Maybe they've been waiting for you to awaken more fully into who you are 
or to come closer to them in some way. Some, there's something there with that. There's something there with that, y'all, about somebody wanting you to come closer to them or elevate in some way where they can access you or where um, they could finally see you for many of you. So that goes back to the videos I was doing before on how somebody needs to start that podcast, that YouTube channel, that extra Instagram page because somebody is looking for you. Y'all? Okay? Watch the video I just posted for the chosen ones, okay? Because I feel like this might be kind of like a, a tied message here. All right, but that is the divine message for the collective for the week. Y'all know I'm, I'm going to be back with some more messages. There's just a lot coming in. I wanted to make sure I at least got this out to you. Um, and for those who don't know, the Pussy Portal program is enrolling right now, honey. Yes! And we have amazing, amazing payment plans. So click on the link in the description box. You're, you're going to want to get in, y'all. Because I teach you the mystical, magical power of the pussy, not just the sexual. We're not just sexual objects. We're so much more than that. We're goddesses, we're high priestesses, and there's a way to tap into the womb space to manifest the life that we want, to heal trauma, to heal generational curses. And for those who have not, okay, you're able to click on the link in the description box and order the book Ancient Future Unity, right? Shout out to the book so that you can read my chapter, The Pussy Portal Healing with Pleasure. And I let you know where all of this stuff come f came from. Why am I talking about it? What was what were the downloads? Why does it matter? Right. Why is this the mission? <laughs> why is this the ministry like playing with your pussy? Why is that the ministry? I don't get that. Well, the book is really going to show you um, why. The Pussy Portal program is a thing and how much it has helped me and my bloodline and my legacy. Y'all, it's real. Also, the Pussy Portal has helped so many women thus far. Literally hundreds of women have been helped by tapping into the magic of the Pussy Portal. So I really want you to get in where you fit in. Classes start February 22nd of this year. So get in, y'all. All right, I love you. I hope that you have an amazing evening. Peace and love.